Well, while the pressure may be on the Vancouver Canucks to bring the cup home, for fans in Victoria in the already packed bars and pubs, uh, having a few drinks watching the crucial game six will feel some pressure of their own. When the game is over and the fans get up to leave, uh, they may need to relieve themselves. And the city says that is a problem downtown with public urination still a big problem in street corners and doorways. Uh, to relieve the issue, council is considering a new public loo. New public washroom may soon be open for business on Langley Street. It would replace this uh, parking space. With council's uh, approval, uh, people will well, have another uh, place to uh, pee Bastion. late at night near Bastion Square. It's part of the city's push to clean up downtown and a relief for nearby businesses who say the square is regularly used as a bathroom. In, in the alley back here, we do you know, see a lot of people using it as a restroom, unfortunately, because they don't have further options once um, you know, restaurants and bars let out. It's about time, for sure. The guys who flush the streets clean feel the same way. The clean team is out cleaning this downtown daily. And some of the complaints that we do receive are specifically with regards to urine. As much as there have been campaigns within the bars, our patrons don't seem to be listening quite as closely as we would like them to. On Thursday, city staff will urge council to buy this new loo. If you've been to Portland, Oregon, you've seen it before. The Portland Loo will cost about $100,000 to purchase and install. That's 60000 more than the public urinal installed at Pandora and Government Streets. City staff say this freestanding urinal has been successful, but it's not exactly female friendly. The new toilets, though, are. It does offer privacy for, for men. It just doesn't work for women. So uh, this one will be um, a little more uh, private. Uh, and a little more comforting uh, for women. If approved, the Portland Loo will be ready to use in just a few months, and more could pop up downtown as the budget becomes available. I've been to lots of uh, cities around uh, North America and in uh, Europe, and the availability of public washrooms uh, is uh, crucial. It's now come to a point where we obviously need uh, more of them, so uh, that's why this one is uh, moving ahead. Council makes its final decision Thursday. In Victoria, Astrid Brownschmidt, A News.